Hey folks, Simon here from Simon's Reviews and today we are taking a look at the Breville Smart Toaster. We purchased this ourselves, my wife and I, which means this is not a sponsored video and we've only been using this so far for a little while. So full disclosure, this is not a long-term review. However, what we've seen so far has thoroughly impressed us both. Now you may notice that our toaster is branded as Sage and that's because Breville is the US brand, Sage is the UK brand, but it is the same company and the toaster is otherwise identical. So right off the bat, this toaster has four uh, compartments, I guess we would call them. And one of the things we really like, my wife and I, is that each of these are a good size. So if you have thick slices of bread, you can make sure that they are evenly toasted, they will fit into this. You can generally position your bread either vertically or horizontally to get the toast that you prefer. I don't know what it is normally with toasters. They are always built in such a way that they can't accommodate a full slice of bread. And by the time they pop up, the top part of the bread is still untoasted. Well, that's just not an issue with this toaster. And also, if you are coming from a more traditional toaster, one of the things you will notice is missing here is the traditional lever for putting the bread down and lifting it back up again. Well, that's because we have these smart buttons. And I tell you what, it actually makes toasting the bread a lot of fun. I know it's sad, isn't it? Toasting bread is not supposed to be fun. But trust me on this, these buttons will do all of the work for you. The toast button, which is of course the main button, you'll click that and then the bread will slowly raise down into the toaster and when it's finished, it will slowly lift back up again. And yeah, that's pretty much how these buttons work. You have a quick look button that will just bring the toast up momentarily and then automatically bring it back down again once you've you know seen how toasted it is. There is the next button here, which is crumpets in the UK. It's labeled as bagels in the US, but it's pretty much the same thing. I believe this only toasts on the one side. You have the defrost option and there is a bit more option, just if you need that little bit extra. And then the other five buttons are a repeat for the other two compartments. And on the bottom you have the timer sliders, one for each side. And what will happen is the LED will slowly systematically start to run down towards number one until effectively it gets to zero and that means the toast is done. Like I say, the fact that each of these is able to accommodate quite a large slice of bread and the fact that you are going to get an even toast all over that slice of bread, I think makes the toaster worth it, even without the smart functions. But the smart functions here are very good. The way that you are able to use this toaster for bagels, for fruit loaves, for defrosting, and the toaster will know how to do that without issue. And of course, most importantly, Good old standard toast, this will do absolutely fine. To perfection, I would say. So yes, we're very happy with it and I hope the video helped. Thanks for watching. 